For thousands of years, China has been home to a rich and diverse civilization with a legacy of inclusiveness that has shaped its history. China's ancient beliefs were marked by diversity exemplified by Confucianism, Taoism, and Buddhism, which coexisted and influenced each other for centuries. China's religious diversity is a testament to its legacy of accommodating different forms of belief and spirituality. This is a fang zhuan. Fang zhuan is what? It is made in the Tang Dynasty. It is made in the Tang Dynasty. This is a square brick. So what was it for? It was used to pave the palace in the Tang Dynasty. This one was unearthed from the famous Da Ming Palace, which was built in the ancient city of Chang'an. This is the Rei Shou grape pattern square brick. The grape pattern is very special because there were no grapes in China before the Tang Dynasty. For example, you don't see them in the Han Dynasty. Grapes came from the West through the ancient Silk Road and are thus a symbol of cultural exchange, which can be found in our daily lives. Apart from grapes, cucumbers, peppers, and other things which all originated from the West. At the same time, our silk and porcelain were transported to the West through the Silk Road, which shows a two-way exchange. This is a piece of porcelain, but what's special about this porcelain is that it's in the image of the Hu people, meaning the nomadic people. Take a look at the deep eye sockets, to the nose, to the high bridge of the nose, and even a beard beneath. At that time, the Tang Dynasty was a very open era, during which merchants from different places traveled on the Silk Road, including the Hu. So there were images of these people on the porcelain. The culture was inclusive and the whole society was open, and there was a high tolerance for people with different views. Mm. Chinese civilization has a long history during which different cultures clashed with each other and developed hybrid forms. It is these processes of integration that helped us achieve balance time and time again. Each time we embraced the difference, it led to the collapse of an old order. But in the process of seeking rebalance, we accommodated some new elements.